the weekly code quiz. First, we will present an overview of the basics to making a website accessible. And then we will go into more detail on how to accomplish each. What is alternative text? Add alternative or alt text for every image, video, or audio. Alternative text is a description of the media that allows those with disabilities to read or hear the content they are not able to view. The object should be described and its purpose on the site explained. Why do we have to add transcripts? Add transcripts for all video or audio content. Transcripts help the hearing impaired understand content that would not be available to them otherwise. Why do we need to state the language of a site in the header code? Clearly state the language on your site in the header code. This helps those using text readers. By identifying the language, it helps the text reader to function accordingly. Is offering an alternative or suggestion helpful? Offer an alternative or suggestion if a user encounters an input error. Sometimes those with disabilities encounter errors when trying to navigate your site. Offering suggestions helps them navigate the content. Why do we make website layouts consistent and organized? Make sure your website has a consistent and organized layout. Menus, links, and buttons should be clearly defined and easy to navigate. Any link should be clearly labeled with descriptions that tell the user what will happen if the link or button is clicked. What is good markup? Good markup is key to making your website accessible. Learning to build your website with clean code that is easy to understand and proper makes your content available to your users. Consider consulting an attorney who specializes in disability law anytime you are concerned that you are not doing enough with regards to ADA compliance. Although we can help you get on the right track, this is not a substitute for legal advice. Presented by Designers Learn Code.